Hi, my name is Pam from Colorado. I'm a former 43-year straight party voting ex-Republican who left her party in early 2016. I left because Trump was going to be the party nominee and I couldn't uh, abide by that. I'm also a devoted Jesus follower who works overseas with refugees as a missionary. I have a message from my fellow evangelicals. Like many of you, I was also a single issue voter. Pro-life has been my litmus test. I voted third party in 2016, but this time the stakes are much too high and I'm gonna be voting for the only man with character in this race and his name is Joe Biden. There are a lot of reasons for this. First of all, pro-life is more than just babies. It encompasses all of life, and this president has shown a plethora of ways that he cares little about the lives of others. On abortion, he delivers only lip service rather than action. A 2019 report from Live Action says that Planned Parenthood spending is at historic levels. Our efforts to limit abortion is best one at the local and state levels, and I've been working hard for that. It's not at the federal level. The knowledge of this frees me from my conscience to vote for a Democrat, not because I'm rationalizing, but it's based on the evidence of what is actually happening. Second, my husband and I have seen firsthand with our travels overseas, the de destructive nature of our president and how that has affected our relationships overseas. We are no longer respected. Thirdly, character matters in a leader. It matters more than political policy because out of character flows wisdom and good decision making. Lastly, and this is the most important for me, I'm voting for Joe Biden to send a message to my fellow Christians about the devastating harm that the embrace of Trump has had on our witness here and around the world. The evil you see in the world cannot be combated with more evil. That is not Jesus's way. <laughs> Politics is not the correct vehicle. Jesus is. We have to restore our witness again, show the love and grace to those with whom we disagree that we're supposed to show and again return to the thing that matters the most to Jesus, and that is the gospel. It's impossible to share that with a shredded witness, and that's what we have now. Our efforts, my husband and I, overseas, has been handicapped by our poor testimony in the United States. That testimony can only be restored, and it's been lost by removing the cause of the damage. Please consider voting this November for the man who's not perfect, who doesn't hold all of my policies in his heart, but is a good man and one who better exemplifies Christ and what Christians are to be about. And that man is Joe Biden. Thank you very much.